Joy. Just let me smell the coffee, please. No. This coffee so much. See, I promise you, as long as you can't drink coffee, I won't drink coffee too. What's wrong, Ibu? I just wish that my Khalid was as loved as your baby is, with two loving parents. Let me show you how much I love you. And you too, Ibu. Me? Yep. What are you up to? <laughs> what is it? I was waiting for the right time to give you this. Where did you get the skin? Well, after Khalid tore the originals, I called the hospital to ask for the duplicates. This is so thoughtful. Thank you, Razali. <laughs> You're the best, I am. I love you so much. <laughs> Nathan, breakfast. What is it? Um, my primary school classmates are having a reunion later. Oh, that sounds like fun. What time is that? I'm, I'm not going. Why? You should. It's always nice to catch up with old friends. Hmm. I wasn't really that close to any of them. You should go. It's better than staying home and being glued to your phone all day. <laughs> you kids seriously don't know how to socialize anymore. But I have to catch up on my school work. What work? You're already done with your placement test. Take a break. I really don't feel like it. Dewi just cut some fruits. Thank you. If baby is a girl, I'm gonna give her the pendant when she's old enough. I haven't seen that for a long time. In Australia, I always kept it close to me. Whenever I felt lost and worried, I would hold it. And think about you and Nene, and I'd feel better. You're both so strong, so it gave me strength too. Yeah. yeah. Zara, what made you worry? Did something happen in Australia? Razali always talks about Australia, but you hardly tell me anything. Uh, anyway, it's all in the past. Hmm? No need to talk about it. For baby's sake, you cannot be sad. Hey, Dad. Hey. Mm. What's this? Yeah, small talk topics, jokes, you know. Helps break the ice at gatherings. Dad, I really don't feel like going to the gathering. Your friends made the effort to reconnect. You should go. It's important to have friends, Nathan. The friends that you make when you are young are somehow the ones who really have your back. What kind of music are balloons afraid of? Pop music! <laughs> you, you, you should tell that joke, and then you tell me how many people laugh. Hmm? Dad, nobody's gonna laugh. So you go in. All right. Yoke. Look, whatever's happening with you and Shen, you... You promise not to interfere. And I won't. Thank you. But you have to promise me that you're going to sort it out soon. I'm trying to. OK, look, if you need anyone to I'll talk... I'll handle it. James, thank you. OK. Hey. Want to get lunch? Um, I'm having lunch with Ilya. That's nice. Yeah, we haven't had time to spend with each other. I've been so busy. Another day? Sure. Hey. 
Free for lunch? I think I'm just going to order something in. Fine. Hey, Zara's meeting Ilya for lunch. So? Well, he said something about spending more time with her. That doesn't sound like a man who's in love with another woman. I think you should just go ahead and consent to Rosnani adopting Khalid. Zahar is so deep in denial. He doesn't even realize he's in love with Rosnani. You're just being paranoid. And you're being naive. Just because he's going for lunch with Ilya doesn't mean he can't be in love with Rosnani. Don't forget the jokes, okay? You have it with you, right? Hey. Anyway, just keep this in case you get hungry when you're out. Dad, I really don't feel like going. I'm not ready. I'm still getting used to being back in Singapore. Just go and say hi at least, okay? Hmm? Dad, I really don't feel like it. I'm sorry. Don't have to say sorry to me, Nathan. It's, it's not my party. I just wanted you to have fun. I, I promise I'll go the next time. Sure. Yeah. Oh, you keep it for the next time you meet your friends. Swell fair. Young is seeing Ella? Of all people. And nobody knew? How did he cover his tracks? That's not important. It has happened. Don't you think it's so interesting that within the same body... The question is... What do I do about it? Do you know? Do you mean like if I read a dating guidebook for DID? Have you? There isn't such a thing, right? No, but it would be interesting to do a study on the... Zarif! What do I do? Okay, the goal of DID treatment is better integrated functioning whenever possible. What does that even mean? It means better communication and coordination between the altars to make life easier. It, it's still so hard for me to think of Yang as a completely other person who's sharing a body with Shen. Yoke, you can't just get rid of Yang. The idea comes about when someone has to endure more than a person can handle alone. Shen needs Yang. They're different, but they're still part of one whole. They need each other. quiet today. Okay. Um, something wrong? They just told me I have to go on a work trip. Oh. When? How long? Tomorrow, one night. <laughs> That's not too bad. It's bad. I don't want to be away from you at all. Ibu and Abang will make sure I'm okay. Hmm? Hey, me. You need me. Yoke, I need you to sign off on these minutes. Thanks. Shira. Yes? The other day, you said you didn't think that Young was a bad person. Yes. Why? Did he do something? No, nothing. I have to get this done, but we can talk about this tomorrow. Sure. You want to talk to Yang right now, in the middle of the day? That's right. What for? You know what for. You found out about Ella? Mm-hmm. I only just found out about it too. I was going to tell you about it. I can come over now to talk. You had time to tell me, but you didn't. I waited for you to say something, but you didn't. 
There was never a right time. You had your chance to explain. Now I'm going to do what I have to do. I want to talk to Yang. Fine. I'll clear my schedule. Come over later. I thought it was because of Australia and he was not used to the kids over there. But Nathan is still as shy as ever. You shouldn't have let him get out of the outing. He said he'll go for the next one. And of course, you believed him. Yibo? Eh? I didn't know you were coming for lunch. Yeah, I had a meeting around here and I wanted to see you before I head back to work. See me? Mm hmm Zali? Hey. Why do you look so blur? Wasn't there a toilet around here? Young? Hi. Where's the toilet? Where's Shen? He's supposed to have a meeting later with the residents. It's been postponed. Check your email. But... Sorry, bro. But I really need that toilet. Yoke's coming over and I need to go. Just round the corner. Round the corner? Awesome. Make sure she eats well, doesn't overwork, or stay up too late, you know. Mm -hmm. Razali, I look after her for more than 18 years before you turn up. I think I know what to do. I know Ibu, but she is expecting now. And she just doesn't know how to take care of herself properly. Go for your trip. I'll make sure Zara is OK. Hmm? okay Thank you, Ibu. Go. OK. What are you talking to Ibu about? I'm just giving her reminders about you. And... I'm going to set a few reminders in here for you as well. What's that app, huh? Oh, there it is. I've set alarm for you to message me every hour when I'm away tomorrow. I wouldn't forget. I'll make sure you won't. Hi. Hello. You look comfortable in that chair. Never would have picked it myself. This table. That cup. The shirt, even. Never would have picked any of it if I had a choice. But I don't, do I? I never have a choice. I'm sorry. I'm just... <clears throat> frustrating, you know? I don't know what we're going to talk about, but before we do, I want to apologize. For seeing Ella? For the stuff that's happening. The stuff that happened in the past. Like when I first met you and accused you of being a cheater. You're apologizing for one thing to make me miserable. I didn't have to. I didn't have to confront that policeman Matthew either. But I couldn't help it. Shen was devastated and I do what I always do. Which is? Get angry for him. Why do you have to get angry for him? Oof, that started way back. Shen told you about his mother, yes? A little bit. <laughs> she was one stressed out and strict woman who expected perfect behaviour from Shen. So Shen never did dare to talk back to her. So I did. You stood up for him. I stood up for us. So when you broke up with Shen, and Shen didn't do anything, I had to. I said what Shen wouldn't say. But you were wrong about Matthew and I. You didn't know everything, but you just barged in. You got angry because you wanted to. You are just saying you want to help him, but you are hurting him more than you were helping. I know. I was angry and scared after surfacing for I don't know how long. So, this stunt with Ella, is it just another attempt to hurt me? Because I don't see how this is protecting Shun. 
I didn't think I would fall in love with her. You love her? I admit, years ago when I looked up Ella, it was just to buck Shen. I didn't expect I would fall in love with her. I didn't know I could fall in love with anyone, but... There's nobody like Ella. So, are you going to sneak out every night to go and see her? I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know how it's all going to work out. All I know is that I love her. And I don't want to lose her. Ella thinks you are Shen. If you want to be with her, that means Shen has to break up with me. I won't let that happen. I know. So either you end it with Ella or tell her the truth. That you are not Shen. See how she takes it. I don't want to end it. Are you willing to tell Ella everything? Zara! When do you get back? Uh, hi. Zara, you didn't tell my Sarah you were back? We've been so busy since we got back. I can't wait to hear everything you've been up to. It's been so long, right? Um, I have to head home, but it was nice seeing you. Nice seeing you? I thought you two were close. I thought so too. Did you get young to stop seeing Ella? No. Was he being difficult? It's the situation that is difficult. What's so difficult? He just has to stop seeing her. And that's your solution? And how do you think we should go about it? Make Yang pretend to be you and break up with Ella again? I... Or tell Ella the truth before breaking up with her? What if she uses it against us? I don't know how to do it. Whatever the case, things can't go on like this. I know it can't. If we had kept a closer watch on him like I suggested, this wouldn't have happened. Sorry. I never expected this. I thought about it. I think we should let Yang and Ella keep dating. You can't be serious. It's the best way forward. For now. Keep dating? For how long? I don't know. But it's the only option we have. Zarif said cooperation is important. There's a danger of Yang and Ella acting out if we force anything. Zarif said that? If we take things slow, Yang will cooperate and it'll be easier to manage the situation. So you're basically telling me to two-time with you and Ella? It's not two-timing. You and Yang are different personalities. Doesn't our relationship mean anything to you? Don't you care about our commitment to each other? Of course I do! When you thought I was having an affair with Shira, you were perfectly fine to let it carry on as long as I was discreet. I want to do everything I can to make this marriage work. I'll do anything I have to. It's my decision too. And it's going to take a lot for me to agree to this madness. What about Yang? Doesn't he have a vote too? What? It's two against one now, is that it? It's the only solution. If you have a better one, you're welcome to share it. <sighs> Nina, do you have any pencil lead? I'm out. What's wrong, Nina? The pencil lead's in the pencil case. Is it about this morning? Go away. You know, why are you angry with me? I didn't do anything wrong. Yeah, you never do anything wrong. To that, you'll never do anything wrong, Nathan. That's what this is about. You're angry because you think Dad is closer to me? This isn't a competition, Nina. Who says I'm angry? It just annoys me to see how you are around him. Don't be angry, Dad. Oh, I'm so sorry, Dad. Even Nikki stands up to him more. You're pathetic. Nina... I... Will you just get out?
Good night. Yeah, good night. Are you sure you want to tell that to Shen? It's the only option we have. You can't just ghost Ella. Yeah, I don't want to. I'll talk to Shen tonight. Yo. Thanks for believing me. It doesn't matter whether I believe you or not. It means a lot to me. I'm not doing this for you. I'm doing this for Shen. And if you claim you used to protect Shen when you were younger... I did. Then you should protect him now. Figure out a way to tell Ella the truth. Soon. Nothing. She's just very flaky and we just grew apart. There's nothing to talk about. You two could talk for hours. You're right, Kat. <clears throat> I agree Zara should keep in touch with all her friends, but only those that are good for her, not my Sarah. I know my Sarah. I worked with her for a year in the restaurant. She's great. That was a long time ago. I don't think... Razali is right. I always thought my Sarah was very flighty. 